Hey, welcome back to Lazy Gamers. Uh, Div play Divinity Original Sin 2. Huh? When we last left off, this motherfucker knows I'm just playing dead. <laughs> yeah. He's just sat right on top of me, despite Red Prince being a perfectly good target over there. Just waiting for me to get up. But what he doesn't know is I'm not entangled anymore. I can do this. <laughs> Alright, so, I got a plan. What's that? Things like, I missed you guys. Peace out. <laughs> You're on your own. <laughs> Fane's our combat reser. through all this work, get him near dead, and then he just does like an AoE instant kill or something on us, I'm gonna be pissed. <clears throat> you don't wait how much uh, you don't have a way to get your physical or um, uh, magic armor back to you. Uh I can get 20, 27 magic armor back. However, uh I'm just gonna run this way. <laughs> and it auto saved when you did that too. Quick, run, 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 run. I'm out of combat. <laughs> God, that's brilliant. But how are you going to res people? I'm trying to decide, uh. I'm trying to decide what I want to do. <laughs> Wait. Don't allow me to. Oh, hold on. Uh, <clears throat> are you able to not make it over here? Because if not, uh, I could just teleport you. Yes, yes, yes. There you go. <laughs> Alright. <laughs> Out of curiosity, can I. Can you, send, can you send the pyramid to Helma, the prince? Alright, oh, you can yeah. use it in combat, it takes five points. What's this? I found something. <laughs> what the freak did he just find all of a sudden? A dead dwarf. Or maybe this exit here. Uh what? It takes It takes six AP to use. <clears throat> so, I'm just gonna finish off this dwarf. Yeah, I think that's what I'll do. Poor Fane. <laughs> well, that hurt. So are you not able to get enough uh, AP to use it?
Well, I mean, we're healed up. I mean, we could re-engage. Uh, yep. Save. I think that's what I'll... Wait, what the frick is that? What is what? <clears throat> Do you see over there one of the rock walls? Sort of in the middle of the thing there? Can be clicked? Yeah, I think you can climb up it. Alright. Well, let me see here. How do I want to do this? Well, technically, I can do that. What I can do is. combat? Probably. Yeah. Uh, Fane's. I wanted to some Fane's entering combat. <laughs> Alright. Now I need to figure out where to go for Los. Sneak and get to the high ground, maybe? I can't reach that. I wanted to get up here on the left here, but it won't let me. What is this? Wait, before I do anything else, where's. Uh, can I get up on the. <clears throat> hold on, hold on, go back. Let's go back. <laughs> <laughs> I, can, I can get you up on the high ground. Yeah, but Fane has. or on the. Red Prince has the pyramid you already on the. Big cost AP. It doesn't matter, I can get one of us up on the high ground. Okay. <clears throat> uh, I better back up just a little bit more to be on the safe side. <laughs> Are you still out of combat? Yep. Wait, why do you ask? Can I? Um, switch over to Red Prince, see if you can. There you go. You can teleport yep. to me. Check that I'm still hidden. <clears throat> nope. There we go. <laughs> oh, ni Ooh, nice. Let me back, back up so I can set my familiar to fire. Your familiar can hold three source points. Gloriously cheesy, I love it. <laughs> Red Prince, you did a great job. <laughs> and then... <clears throat> oh, jeez, we've already eaten through all of his magical... Yeah, and Fane actually did a nice chunk on his physical, too. Now we just have to, have to hope he doesn't teleport up to us. You know, just when I think we, we may have reached like like the peak of cheesiness, we do something like this. <laughs> oh, if only I had a source point. I'm gonna get rid of his physical armor for you, okay? Sounds good. And then you wanna know what I'm gonna do? Go put him to sleep. Invisible. Uh oh. He actually went to sleep.
Skip his turn. <laughs> Alright. If we do damage to it, though, does he wake up? Uh, yeah. Damn. Yeah. <clears throat> I guess I'll just be. I guess I'll just buff, be buffing this on my turn then. <laughs> Look at how much all my armor Fane has right now. Jeez. <laughs> I'm getting him ready for this shit. <clears throat> I'm gonna help us out too. I really wanted to cast those on Fane on Prince, but he was just out of range. You could save your AP for your next turn. Alright, now we need to run the CC train on him. <laughs> So, first order business. Make this much worse. He's crippled. <laughs> and then... Can't tell if that's hitting pain or not. <coughs> Are you able to hit on like the right side of him? He's crippled and chilled now. Now it's Fane's turn. Atrophy. What are his immunities? Slipping an acid. Good. That's great. You have magic armor, right? Yep. Yeah. Okay. Prepare Terrified. <laughs> <laughs> yeah, I sent you one of those grenades. <coughs> what does it even do? Uh, makes them run away. <laughs> I guess I can save uh, knockdowns until, Yep. like, the next turn. Yeah, we need to run the CC train on him. Just beat the shit out of him right now. Prepare yourself. God, he has so much HP. I want to freeze him on my next turn, if I can. Can you shock him, maybe? He's chilled, so I'm, uh... Oh, he's weak to water. Nice, he's stunned. <laughs> oh, status Wait. effects are god. <clears throat> Wait, is he really weak to... He's weak to water. Oh, that might be because he's... Right, now he's immune to uh, a whole bunch of stuff. Is it because we, uh... Maybe it's because he's stunned? Ah, yeah, stunned gives him immunity to frozen, terrified, petrified, taunted, and sleeping. But that'll be gone on, uh, on the next turn. He has negative... Oh, wait, chilled on, uh... Reduces resistance, okay. What are you thinking?
I can probably freeze him on my next turn. Only uh, 1,400 more HP to go. I'm out of CC I'm, uh, after this wears off. So get ready for your stuns on <coughs> Prince's next turn. Or your All next right. turn, whichever. Wait, does he heal from poison? Like, so, some of these fights are kind of ridiculous, but if you're able to get rid of, on a lot of them, if you're able to get rid of their defenses, you could just run a CC train on them. Yep. Which arguably is very needed against this asshole. <coughs> he hurts. A lot. Using any of my fire spells because I wasn't sure if they'd break fr uh, frozen. Oh, they will. Um, <coughs> I'm gonna delay my turn. Right? <coughs> he got magic on with that. Did he really? Yeah. It's only 36 though, so it'll it'll go good. <laughs> I almost feel bad for this asshole. Prepare yourself. I like how when he's stunned on the ground, they he still twitches. See Fade, he's under him. Yeah. <laughs> Ow. It's fine, I still have magic armor. That missed, I think. No, I hit him. <clears throat> Not for a lot, but it hit him. I have 
I have two more knockdowns. I have one on my summon and one more on Prince. Nice. <laughs> oh, and look at that. Fane has magic armor. Wait, what? Did you click on the... I clicked on his portrait. <clears throat> huh. Um, weird. Oh, I clicked the wrong spell. That's why. I restored our magic armor. <laughs> this guy, he was like, I will become the most powerful ever. And now he's getting beat down like crazy. <laughs> I almost feel bad for him. <coughs> so now he's going to get even more bleeding. Wait, how did he get physical armor? Oh, he recovered from CC, so he gained shit back. Oh, uh, well, that makes sense. Yeah. But he is bleeding. Yeah, from pain. Um. Now he's diseased. <laughs> oh. And he's sleeping. <laughs> Just go ahead and beat him, but I'm not uh, do whatever he needs to do. And now he's knocked down. <laughs> so many debuffs on him. more insult to injury. <laughs> oh god! I wish I could just teleport him just to... Just to... <laughs> and he's poisoned! Your familiar is going to finish him off. Style. <laughs> Mercy! Mercy! Oh god, Fane's the one doing the conversation. <laughs> <coughs> the master sorcerer throws up his popped, cracked arms to defend himself as you step forward. <laughs> Say that you'll consider Mercy, but there's something you need from him first. The undead dwarf looks quickly over its shoulder, his gaze darting from shadow to shadow. Of course, of course, anything, just name it. <laughs> you need to learn more how, learn how to channel more sores. If he helps you, he might walk out of this cave. <laughs> <coughs> that could be useful for Fane, depending on what it is. What? <clears throat> sores? I... The skeleton slowly lowers his arms. St of course. You're Godwoken. You seek power. Ultimate power. <laughs> and I'm worried we could not find common ground. Yes, Godwoken, <coughs> I can teach you. No, oh, now he wants to be all friendly. <laughs> if you swear, you won't banish me to the afterlife. <laughs> You're not sure. It looks like someone's beating you to it. <laughs> Death of the flesh is one of the smallest deaths. I have not passed on to the <coughs> Hall of Echoes, do nor do I ever intend to. Please, Godwoken, let me walk away, and I swear I will show you all I know. That, that is not important. Just please tell what me. What do you think? We have an accord Said he's not in any position to bargain, or if he keeps his word, we'll, we'll keep ours. I like the note, he's still his burning. <laughs> yeah, he's burning and he's got hardly any HP. <laughs> and no magic armor. <clears throat> Freeze be very well, Godwoken. Listen carefully. I'm still going to kill him, if it lets me. 
a source and a void, like I day and night, love and hate. Which One is meaningless without the other. To grow your source, See, to achieve Morbius, your potential, you must spirit. embrace the void. The grinning skeleton reaches into the folds of his robes and pulls out a small black mass. It's covered in veins and he's somehow involved with Lo uh... Yeah, he was part of Lohar's gang before he became undead. Here, God Woken. Right. Take a bite. And Mortis was ordered to kill Lohar. We gave the letter about Mortis. Yeah. Trying to assassinate Lohar. Shrug your shoulders uh... and sink your teeth into the black foul or. He, gave, he was like, you, you must embrace the void, too, um, uh, to increase your power. And he pulled something out that yeah, looks like a heart. It's like, take a bite. Shrug your shoulders and sink your teeth into the black fouled organ. Look at him disgust. What is that? You're not eating anything's heart. Demand you tell you another way. Eh, I'll take a bite. The thick pus explodes into your mouth, coating the inside of your skull. Biting down, you can feel the flesh is tough and gritty. You've never been so grateful to be missing a ton. <laughs> <laughs> Deep within you, you feel something change. Mortis Your awakens. soul opens up, and you feel it swell as new channels for source start to flow through you. You swallow all <clears throat> you can, and despite the meat in your stomach, so you that feel was a Mortis new superior. space inside you, do, 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 do. a potential Mortis waiting to, to be filled. With our source powers. There, I the held up of my end of the bargain. King, the I did as you asked. And now I'm getting as far so from this cave as my bones closed, will take me. So has fishy business. Um. So, let's see. What do you think? He want, he's moving to walk away. Let the undead creature waddle away. He did his part. Step to the side and block him. You still have some questions. Lash out with your foot as he walks by, knocking him to the ground. He didn't really think he was going to survive this, did he? What do you think? <clears throat> well, Lohar did mark our did give us the quest to go kill Mortis. He asked us to kill Mortis. Hmm. Um, yeah. <clears throat> so it's up to you. I'm just pointing out that's what the one dwarf that we found in that's like a kingpin, I think, or something like that. Yeah. <clears throat> Kind of an interesting character. Hmm. <clears throat> Did you remember what the other thing, like the old, uh, oh crap, it won't let me see what those are. I was wondering what other things there were we could ask him about that I couldn't remember. Because there's also, well, uh, actually, because you remember the, <clears throat> in on, in Wardus' house, there was also like, like a secret, uh, like a passageway that we needed a gym for to be able to open it. You know what? This guy's evil as fuck. I mean, he possessed a whole bunch of fucking dwarves, raised a whole bunch of void woken and everything. Yep. He's fucking dying. Mordus looks at you in shock. His skull twists into a mask of rage as comprehension dawns and oblivion opens before him. <laughs> Liar! Traitor! I hope he rips your guts out your ears! The frail skeleton is still screaming obscenities when you bring your weapon down, caving in his skull. I'm pretty sure the Jack will cave silent, in a skull, Dropping to the floor with a crack, and the pile of bones lies silent. <sighs> Now I have two, we have two source points. <clears throat> oh, we all do. Whoa. Nifty. Huh, we found a key. Wonder what it unlocks. Probably all the shit behind him. Alright, so he dropped an amulet. Um, it's Mortis's amulet. 42 magic armor. Plus one constitution. Plus 20% fire resistance. Plus one necromancer. Reflect 10% of melee damage as fire damage. Huh. So you're the necromancer. <clears throat> the one that I have is... Yeah, the one that I have is plus one in, plus one necromancer, so I'm gonna give that to uh, you. If you want it. 
It's 42 magic armor on net. Not... Just... We can just... And plus so one constitution. <clears throat> well, mine's plus one persuasion, plus one arrow thurge. Hmm. Right, so, the, the arrow... Th yeah, trade fodder. We've, we've got a shitload of that, actually. Alright, so there is an entire room that uh, we missed. Well, not really missed. I have no idea how the hell we fucking pulled that victory out of our ass. Uh, oh! By there is a cursed way? oil barrel right here. Huh. huh. It's a good thing that didn't go off during all that. <laughs> yep. I think that was pure luck that we were able to do that. <laughs> yeah, that was fucking pure luck. Yoink. What'd you find? I just grabbed the cursed oil barrel. <laughs> I'm wondering Save. if I can make cursed. Oh yeah, yeah, definitely. If I can make cursed oil grenades or something like that, that would be interesting. Then you can make your own necro fire to screw us over. Yeah. Letter from Dwarven Queen. Read. Okay, so the dwarves here, including Lohar, um, they're behind making all this. Um. Uh, all this death fog that um uh, well they're they're making death fog. It's plain and simple. I don't I don't think I like the dwarves anymore, man. Fun. I found a hole. Commence the looting! This hole takes us where that one person with the source caller was. Somehow we never, like, detected the frickin'. No idea. The hole. Melting away. Oh. More just turned the key into an amulet. Coming. Oh. His amulet on uh opened this up. Wow. Lovely. Entire another sprawling place of doom. Let's just get this chest. <clears throat> And I thought this cave couldn't get any more grim. I found a new source skill. I do not me. want to know what that smell is. Cool. Arcane Stitch. Death, Fully likely. restore targets Watch the target character's step. magic armor, frozen, removes frozen, stunned, petrified plague, suffocating poisoned, burning necrofire, terrified silence, taunted and mad. Restores 100% of max magic armor. Takes three three ability points and a source point. Or AP and a source point to use. And found hmm. these to identify. <coughs> what does this look like up over here? Oh, that's pretty grim. I'm yep, going to check it out next time though. <coughs> what? So I'll have to check it out next time though, probably. Yeah, looks like I'm uh, it is that time. Well, uh, that's the deal for us this time here on Lazy Gamers. Uh, hope you enjoyed the video. Thanks for watching, and uh, we'll see you again next time. Have a good one.